Punished at page 108 of the Programme for Government states that the development of agriculture and food sector is a fundamental priority and that the priority for agriculture is rewarding farmers for high quality produce. The beef sector, as you know, is currently in deep crisis and of course the factors that have added to that are factory prices, poor factory prices, the current Brexit scenario and currency fluctuation in addition to proposed reduction to the cap budget. Beef farmers, the length and breadth of this state, are experiencing serious financial losses and the five cent per kilo drop for beef last week has impacted further on an already bad situation. I know in my own constituency there are farmers in Leash and Offaly struggling to pay household bills and in great hardship at present. What actions and interventions, apart from the newly announced loan scheme for businesses and farmers, apart from that, what actions and interventions will be put in place to assist our farming families, particularly in the beef sector, who are experiencing great financial hardship at this time? Uh, for, for your question and particularly on the focus on, on, on the beef sector, as you're aware, uh, we place significant emphasis in the context of a functioning market that there is adequate competition in, and particularly in the area of live exports. You may have seen uh, in, in one of the agri publications today of significant interest in terms of uh, cattle for live export to Libya. That's an ongoing issue in terms of competition. Also in terms of the resources that the state can put into the industry, you'll be aware in, in the most recent budget we put in uh, a new initiative in the Beef Environmental Efficiency Programme. We increased the payments in the ANC. We cannot, nor should we, interfere in the market relationship uh, in terms of being able to influence prices at factory level. But what we are also doing is trying to facilitate the organisation of farmers as a collective so that instead of negotiating on a one uh, farmer supplier uh, dealing with the factory that through producer organisations that they can have greater clout and we've seen a manifestation of that in the most recent development between Keypac for example and Glanbia in terms of producing to the market and being able to get a premium price for it and I would urge a variation of that theme is producer organisations and that's another area where we're Thank you very directing much. support to the beef sector.